All right, so if you want to automate your DMs, right, you see people doing this on Instagram where DM me the word freedom and I'll send you my free training, right? And then it sends you the document or grabs your email. I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. Up until now, ManyChat has been the best software to do this. But the reality is ManyChat can get really expensive because as you grow and as you add more contacts, ManyChat just keeps taxing you, right? So I'm going to show you how to automate this with Go High Level which is $97 flat, no matter how many contacts you add. Plus it does a million other things to help you run your online coaching business or agency, course creator, anything you're doing online, high level is really the one-stop shop. I've been using it for five years. So I'm gonna dive in and show you exactly how to set it up so you can get to automating. But if you're new here, my name is Adam Lucky. I've been running businesses for the last 14 years. My goal of this channel is just to share with you what's working, what's not working, all of the experiences I've had to help you build businesses with more freedom in mind, right? More profit, because I've done it the other way where it's very high, high stress and little profit and little fun and lots of stress. So I call that the freedom creator way. And one of the pillars is leverage. So we're gonna dive into that because uh, automation falls under leverage. You want more freedom, you gotta have some leverage in your business, all right? So let's dive in here. So once you get into your high-level account, let's say you're brand new, um, I'm gonna show you how to build it. You're gonna go to automations, right? Down here on the, on the left-hand side, you can create a workflow, um, start from scratch. You can do that. I'm gonna show you one that I've already built. Okay, so let's, so let's say you have a lead magnet. Right, and you're getting inbound DMs every day. You're getting like three, four, maybe 10 inbound DMs and you're having to manually respond and you're, maybe you're not even collecting emails, right? Which is a huge problem. If you're not collecting emails and you're just relying on Instagram, you can get shut down on Instagram. Like that's happened. People's businesses literally getting shut down overnight because they lost their Instagram account. Okay, so you need to have traffic that you own which high level is also an email management software as well. So you got to be able to uh, capture emails. So let's talk about the trigger. This is the trigger. This is what initiates the entire automation. So I have it set up where it's an Instagram DM and then the exact match phrase is the word freedom. So whenever anybody messages me on Instagram, the word freedom, it's going to trigger this whole host of items these action steps right so to set up that trigger you just go to click to add new trigger type in IG um, actually you, you're gonna type in customer replied excuse me this is the proper way to do it customer replied and then you're gonna go to filters you're gonna go down here to reply channel Instagram DM okay and then click add another filter this could be, you know, contains the phrase or it's an exact match phrase, depending on how you want it set up. If it's a unique word, then I would do exact match phrase. Because if it's a common word and that someone just drops it, then your automation is going to fire and you don't want to do that. So type in freedom and then just click save trigger or whatever word you want to use, grow, whatever you want. All right. So for me, I add a tag. This is how I organize all of my leads in high level. So I just have a simple tag there that I assign. And you just click these plus signs to add any type of um, action step. The next one is Instagram DM. So they send me the DM, freedom. I have it simply, simple message. Cool, what's a good email? And I'll shoot it over. All right. That's the next message they get. And then I have this wait step. So once again, let's just click the plus sign to show you how to do it. Instagram DM, right? That's how you set up the DM. And then the wait, you just click plus sign, type in wait, boom. And I have this here, so it gives them about a minute to reply. Okay, it gives them a minute to reply their email. Because the cool thing is, when they reply with their email, the software high level is automatically, automatically going to populate their contact information within the CRM with that email. So you don't have to do anything with it. Like literally, right? So here's an example. Type in the word freedom. It says, cool, what's a good email? And I'll shoot it over. I respond. 
the email like within the software it's literally going to populate their email so these are like contacts these are like all the conversations it will add the email right in here this is not the exact um, email that I put here because I was using it multiple times testing it out right so it'll take that and it'll put it right in here without you having to do anything which is super cool and then you can also reply to all of your IG leads from high level like this is game changer because the Instagram DMs can get super claustrophobic unorganized and it's just a hot mess right so um, another cool thing is let me go back to uh, part of the automation I have set up is updating the pipeline. So I have a pipeline here I created, which is a simple sales pipeline, a progression of like they're a lead to signed up. Right? Where are they in the stage of from cold to sold? It's good to be able to know so you don't get confused and you can quickly follow up with like the hot leads and all that good stuff, right? So let's say they message me the word freedom. I'm going to put them right here under lead magnet requested. Uh, this is just an example pipe that I'm still, man, I'm, I'm going to set this up uh, you know, more detailed. Uh, let's say they request your offer doc, which is one of the sales assets we use to sell our offers. Then they'll get automatically moved here. Let's say they book a call. They get automatically moved here. Because right, within the high-level software, if you don't know, it replaces Calendly. It replaces any type of scheduling software. It does all of that as well. So everything is neatly organized in one area. So if they book a call on the calendar, they'll get moved here. Um, you know, if they, if they sign up, they'll just move them here. But you can add as many stages as you like here um, to help you organize your sales pipeline. Okay, so let's go back to the automation. Show you how to complete this. By the way, if you want a free 30-day trial, which you really can't get in many other places for high level, usually they give you a 14-day trial, but I'm, I'm pretty cool like that. <laughs> I've been with high level for a long time, so they hooked me up with a 30-day trial. That'll be in the description below. You can grab that. All right, let's go back into it. So I have the weight, and then I have the condition here set up. And the, the condition is called if else. This part's a little bit complicated, not really, depends on how tech you are, but um, how I have it set up is the basic condition is email is not empty, All right? So if it meets this condition and the email is not empty, they're going to be moved to the uh, email, right? They're going to be moved to this branch of action items. If, they, if there is no email, then it's going to go down here. I'm going to have it wait. For another 60 minutes and then I'm gonna send another DM hey did you still want me to shoot over that training follow-up right people are busy so it's just having I mean you can have a whole chain of events but I like to keep a good balance between a ton of automation and that human connection especially in the world with AI and tons of automation it's good to establish that rapport shoot someone a voice note on Instagram just keep it authentic and connected that's how I like it, at least. So let's say they do drop their email. What's going to happen is we're going to send them an email with the training. Great. Here's the training you requested. And this is via email. So all you do here is just fill in your info, your email, the subject headline. Click the e uh, add the link to your training. Boom. P.S. Let me know if you have any questions, something like that. And you can test your email. Just click save action boom and then immediately after I have a, another DM hey great just sent it now from this email check spam if you don't see it because sometimes just like any email provider if it's a new email it can get dropped in their spam box okay so this just gives them a confirmation lets them know to check the spam and you can like once again you can set this up however detailed you like but it's super simple once you have it set up especially if you have a high volume of DMs coming in it's super important to not delay right not uh, let these leads slip through the cracks there it would suck if you have five 
people requesting your lead magnet every day, you know, having to go in and, and get their email and all that. So this will save you hours of time. Okay. Depending on, obviously, if you have no volume, you have no leads coming in, then we got to fix that problem. But you can check out my other YouTube videos on the direct brand method, the direct brand funnel, running IG ads, all that good stuff to really increase your traffic flow. So that is how you set it up. Um, oh, wait, there's one other thing I didn't show you. I don't think I had in here. Add to the opportunities pipeline, all right? Right, right, here we go. So I'm gonna add this in. Oper create an update opportunity. This is what's gonna add them to that pipeline I created. So they're in the pipeline Instagram stage, lead magnet requested. That's all I'm gonna do. Save action, save, always make sure to save. All right, hope you found this helpful. Comment below if you have any questions, happy to answer. And oh, last thing. For the complete newbies, just real quick on integrating, you got to go to settings here. Go to integrations, go to your Facebook page, and just click connect, and it'll prompt you to connect your Facebook page. You just got to make sure your Instagram is connected to a Facebook business page, and all of this will work just fine. All right. That is all I got for you, my friend, and we will see you later.